Hi, my name is Kate Harris. I'm a student in Wellness 110, and this is my message to myself. Um, I have learned a lot about myself through wellness. Um, I've learned that some of my current practices when it comes to my well-being are not as good for myself as I had originally thought they were. And I also learned that I am rather hard on myself a lot of the time, and I need to be easier on myself. And two ways that I have worked to improve that through what I've learned in this class, um, the first practice that I've taken from class is meditation um, as um, a practice of stress management. Um, meditation is, like with meditation, I basically take five or ten minutes and just sit in silence and, like, darkness in my room and just reflect and on like what's going on in my life and it kind of just gives me a mental break which is very helpful being a stem nursing major even though i'm only a freshman um the other practice that i've taken is um to improve my time man management by making a time management quadrant um this basically helps me know what's most important, what needs to get done, and what, yeah, what's not as important and I, what I can do later. Um, two practices that I'm considering. The first practice is using safety equipment and safe practices and motions in the workplace, both currently in my job as a CNA and in my future job as a nurse. Um, this will be very important to my physical well-being to prevent pain or injury and it will also be important to my emotional well-being because if I'm in pain I'm most likely to resent my job and I really don't want to do that because helping people is the most important thing to me. Um, so if I'm not in pain and I'm protecting myself I'll be more happy and content with my life. Um, the second practice I'm considering is gratitude writing and journaling, especially as I said before, as I'm really hard on myself sometimes. So gratitude writing will help me in that sense of just like focusing on what's good or even just not bad in my life at the moment. And rather than fo focusing on the things that I'm not doing good and I need to be better at because that is something that I struggle with. Um... And, um, yeah, basically now I just would like to encourage myself to continue flourishing. Um, f I've learned that flourishing is to grow in a healthy way and be well emotionally, socially, intellectually, and physically. I want to encourage myself to continue to grow and flourish by learning from my mistakes and from others' mistakes and just reaching out and meeting new people and taking time for myself when I need it. Um, if I continue to grow and flourish for myself and become a better person, I can encourage others to do the same thing, which is all I want in life is to help other people feel better about themselves. So I can only do that by helping myself first. Thank you.